it's alright, I'll be fine. It's just a matter of time. Hello guys, you're welcome back to Glee Info YouTube channel and thank you so much for stopping by. And today we'll be discussing about the 17 years old girl who went viral on social media a few days ago because of her angelic voice. Her case is a pure case of from grass to grace. And yeah, a lot has changed about this little girl in just a matter of few days. And just before we continue with her story, what has happened and what is happening in her life right now, please, if you're just watching for the first time or you've been watching without subscribing, please do us a favor by clicking on the red subscribe button down below to subscribe also on the notification button. In that way, anytime we upload a new video, they will notify you. Thank you. Yeah, we all might not have met the young girl, Sally in person but we all have heard about her angelic voice sally is a young girl from emo state who hawked plantain for her parents for a living sally is just 17 years old who have no one to support her according to the little girl in one of her interviews she was asked if her parent knows that she sings and she said Yes, but they couldn't do anything to support her musical career. But on that fateful day that God remembered her just in a twinkle of an eye, her life changed. On that fateful day, she was going home with her tray, which she used to sell plantain. Maybe probably she was singing to herself as usual before luck met her. This story needs to make our mind strong and get more closer to God because there is nothing he cannot do. No situation is bigger than God and everything has time and season. Who ever thought that Sally the plantain seller would be a very big star within few hours after her video? went viral even the people that bought plantain from her on that day never knew that that day would be the last day she would sell on the street of Oweri for her poor parent yeah let it not surprise you that little sally has gotten business deals from our top music celebrities here in nigeria and even outside nigeria people like don jazzy rema and the most shocking part of it is that rihanna has also called her the 17 years old street hawker who became a section due to her voice has been invited for an interview on cable news network cnn with Kristen amapo after sally's video went viral things began to set in place for her very quickly her talent have also scared the shows of nigeria as happy sally told her fans that she got a call from multi award-winning superstar rihanna Tagging the tweet was a celebrity TV presenter, Kristen Amapo, who acknowledged that Sally was a star and inspiration to many people all over the world. Kristen Amapo further extended an invitation to Sally, inviting her to tell her story on her television show. It was earlier reported that in Nigeria, the race to sign Sally into a record label has been a many horse race, with the best recording labels in the country struggling to get her signature. Chocolate City, the label that produced stars like M.I., Abaga, Ice Prince, Brimo, and now Black Bonnets, and CK even had to come on social media to ask her to sign for them. But Don Jazzy, who is reported to be leading the race to sign her to Marvin Records, countered Chocolate City Music by telling them to leave Sally for him. He even concluded that she will rock the same stage with Rema and Ira Star. All right, and that is the story of Sally, the plantain seller, currently. Indeed, God is wonderful. Who on earth would ever thought that the ordinary plantain seller, the little girl that is always seen on the street of Oweri, under the rain, under the sun, shouting, buy your plantain, buy your plantain, would get to this point in such a short period of time. I have always known that God is a protocol breaker and he does things his way. Now, therefore, this should be a great lesson for all of us. Do not be ashamed to exhibit your talent when opportunity comes knocking. You watching me right now could be the next Sally. You could be the next big thing. Had it been uh, Sally was shy on that very fateful day or she said no, that she will not sing for the people that discovered her. Who knows? They might have just walked away and she will remain a plantain seller. But God of the poor 
said no on that day. Sometimes we lose great opportunities because we are shy, because we are not as spoken. Sally was so confident in herself and as spoken, and here she is today being celebrated. The whole world is hearing about her. Let us always be courageous and always grab every opportunity that comes our way because you may not see such opportunity again when you miss it. God bless the womb that gave birth to Sally. God bless the people that discovered her talent and her destiny. And may the name of the Lord be praised forever. I'm just going to leave you all to share your thought with me on the comment section. Tell me, how did you hear about Sally? Do you know her in person? What do you think about her talent? Do you think she will go far with her talent? And let's gist on the comment section. Let me know what you think. And with that, I'll say thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to share this video. Like and subscribe. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.